Oh, come on, come on, come on. Hey, there it is. Ah, yes. Boom. I'm not gonna start the video with this thing going. That is a really nice Christmas gift my wife got me, and uh, yeah, I got Star Monsters in there right now, but that may change. We'll see. Maybe these Draco heads will go in it. Speaking of which, let's open up some Draco heads. I've got a whole box of the nice, I believe the revised 2009 edition. This isn't the original. This is like the revamp kind of version of Draco heads and the nice cool packaging here. And uh, I've been dying to get into these. As you guys may or may not have seen, I did a short where I actually unboxed a fully sealed pristine condition original box of Draco heads, but I've had this one around for a little bit. You can see the box isn't in the best of shape, but all the packs are here. They're all fully sealed and falling. And I've been dying to get into these because they look like a lot of fun. Kind of the uh, European edition of Gogo's Crazy Bones. These were only for Europe. Uh, they didn't come over to the US, but there is a pretty good following for these guys. There's golds in here, there's silvers, there's jellies, there's all sorts of goofy looking globs of characters that look to be like a lot of fun to open up. So that's what we're going to do today. I'm really curious. I don't know much about these other than kind of what I just said. I know Draco is the most rare figure to find. So we're gonna wanna look for him and a few others, like there's a ghost character. They kind of are very semi-similar to the original series of Gogo's Crazy Bones. So you'll see a lot of different uh, or relatively similar characters with their own weird aesthetic. <laughs> One of the differences between this and Gogo's though is they are all nicely painted. There is actually quite a few that are just painted figures, which is awesome, but we're gonna open them up. There is the nice looking box. Leave a like on the video and let's get into it. All right, nothing really crazy to see on the box. All the little jargon and randomness. I can't even show you the whole box on the camera, but it's all kind of the same. And inside we got all the packs all fully sealed. So let's grab a few. We'll set this one up how it should be as it would have looked on the shelves. Again, these packs look to be a very very cool, well-designed packs. Again, this is this is the revamp version of it, so it'll be interesting to see when I do eventually open up that other original series set box, uh, what the biggest difference are between quality and you know how it's structured and the packs are as far as quality-wise. So let's open our first one up. Let's see what we can get in here. All right, I know there's a few people in the GoGo community that do collect these. So you guys are gonna have to give me any details you can about these guys if you have more information other than what I dropped. But here's the full list. It is pretty nice that you get a full list of characters. I forget what his actual name is, but I really want that guy. He looks really cool. There's a couple really, really interesting, unique ones. Of course, Draco himself. Uh, there's like this dude, demon dude looking dude, ghost. Ghost looks pretty sweet. If we get him in the right paint job, I think that'll look cool. But yes, a full checklist, unlike some of the Go-Go's where they kind of split up the checklist and stuff like that. I always found that annoying. Just give me the full checklist so I can see everything on it. And they include the names, which bonus because they didn't do that in Go-Go's either. <laughs> but now let's see what characters we got here. All right, we can kind of compare a little bit what kind of stuff we have. So we did get a nice painted one off rip. And again, like, these seem like good quality. They're not too bad. They've got a nice weight. They've got a nice little finger indentation there in the back, which is pretty funny. I kind of like it. It's very like appealing to hold. And you know, for this being over like, I don't know, 12 years old or something, this is in pretty good shape so far. Let's see what other ones we have in here. Oh, oh, we got a jelly. We got a nice jelly. Look at that little top hat, man. Interesting. And again, like, Come on, that's pretty good, right? Had to change up the lighting a little bit. Hopefully that helps a bit, but there we go. First jelly, not too shabby. And we have three, we do get three per, and we do get another little cool jelly. I like these, I like them a lot. They look pretty clean. I will say this one does feel a little bit thinner than the other ones we had. So it does feel a little bit lighter. I guess maybe it'll just depend on the character. All right, but let's start cruising through a little bit. It looks like we do just get the checklist in each one. We have a figure falling out. There is the one we just got in a pink, non-jelly. 
again, the painting is actually pretty freaking clean on these, I feel like. Next one, ooh, okay. Same one that we just got actually, but I love this, this kind of, it's almost got that like purple blue vibe to it. It's really nice actually, comparatively to, to this blue. I like this purple a lot. That's sharp. It kind of matches the packaging. Next one or last one from this pack, we got, oh my gosh, we're just getting duplicates for days. This was a complete duplicate pack, uh, match for match, which hopefully we get more variety than that. That wouldn't be good, but he is a cool jelly one. I do like that one. I prefer the jelly over this. Although again, like the paint job, very, very clean. And I have heard people talk about that too, how they really do enjoy the paint job on the Draco head. So it'll be cool to kind of compare. And we didn't really get a lot of cool painted stuff in Go-Go's until the modern series. This guy is cool. I like that. Look at that. That's nice. Nice detail on him. I got to figure out the names. The wiki has the English names, but these do not uh, I don't think, I think it's uh, Le Banana, El Salvador, Unicorno, Le Princesse. I think it's just French on there, which makes sense. And this little weird looking thing, I don't know what's going on. They've got, the only the only downside is some of their girl characters, which even in Go-Go's, the girl characters were always rough. They always just gave them giant lips and terrible looking features. But, oh, look at Ghost. Oh, that is sharp. That is really sharp. I love that. That is super cool. I love that green and black. Okay, gotta get more of him. That is really good. Next one, let's see what's inside here. We got the checklist. Let's get the first one. I'm hoping we find at least one gold. Whoa, he's, <laughs> he's funny. That is a goofy one. It almost looks like he has glasses on. I don't think he does though. His eyes are just set into his head kind of oddly. Oh, here's see again, big kissy lips. I don't even know what the hell. It's so funny. At least they gave her like makeup and stuff, I guess, but it's a, it's a bit much, I think. Let's see what our last one is. We've got one of the blue boys here. Very sharp. Ooh, that one's cool. Wait, is that, that's not Draco, is it? It kind of looks similar, but no, it's not. It's this guy. What's his name? Elrizia. I don't know what that means in English. Maybe I'll put up some names. I probably won't put all the names up on the video. That would kind of be pretty tedious and I do want to just get through this one since I've been teasing it for a while, but I do like this guy a lot. He's a nice looking giant cheeky bone smile, man. Let's do another and see what we can find in here. Checklist. And then we've got, what the heck? Oh, uh, has he got like sores on him? It looks like he has like weird boils on his skin. Boily or something. I think that's what this guy's name actually is. It's something to do with that, I believe. That's weird, but you know what? I'm a fan of this paint coloration. It, they actually did a really good job with it. Ooh, look at you, hey? Ooh, that's interesting. Not the biggest fan of that one. Kind of weird with the mouth, but they can't all be winners, I suppose. The last one though, we've got this big mouth, angry looking unibrow man. That's hilarious. In a nice jelly red, again, nice jelly. Does feel thin on this one. Some of them are. Well, let's do another one. Let's see, get that checklist out and then we will get this guy. Whoa. Now he looks straight up like one of the Go-Go's. Uh, who would it be? I think one from Mutants kind of has a very similar vibe or almost the same exa exact like shape and mold. Oh man, it's like that froggy one from Mutants. That's what it feels like to me. Pretty cool though, pretty cool. I like it, again, it's so funny how they did their molding with that. There's a stamp too, the Draco head stamp. Very sharp, it's number 10. What else we got in here? Ooh, ooh, look at you, Muscle Man. This guy literally is called Muscle Man or something, right? Mr. Muscle, I believe. He's just ripped, he's got the abs. Somehow it's just a big ball with abs, which is hilarious, uh, but a nice one. A nice looking jelly one. Very nice. I like it. And our last one is clanking around. Okay, for a second I thought maybe the clanking might have made it a little gold or silver, but not yet. Not yet. Another big wide-eyed grinned one. Now, is the paint coming off on this one? Almost seems like the paint might be coming off a little bit, but that, you know what? All things considered, it's they're looking pretty clean so far. These guys are hilarious. I like them, man. Not regretting the purchase at all so far. Uh, I wasn't sure if I would enjoy them, but I am. Oh, look at there's a little devil dude. He's got a weird like chin. 
or ball sack underneath them. You know, could be chin, could be balls. I don't know. But I like his design. He looks pretty cool. I like the teeth. Good painting on the teeth as well. That's the other part that's been impressive to me with the paint is they're doing that white teeth effect very sharply, very nicely. Again, another kissy face girl. I don't know why they got to just go ham on the lips on all these figures, but it cracks me up. It's like the artist and design team just didn't know how to, ooh, they didn't know how to design lips any other way. But look at that. That is a cool ghost, man. That is sick. I love that purple. Need to get more of the purples, but that is really cool. Another one. Let's see what's in this one here. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Oh, oh, it's our muscle man. Our muscle man in a normal purple. Looking sharp, looking sharp. And come on, we gotta get a Draco. Gotta get a Draco. Ooh, he's cool looking. I like his vibe. He's got a nice facial, facial feature thing going on. Nice characterization of them. It doesn't look too sloppy or anything. And the last one we've got in here is another one of these kissy faces in a purple. I'm not too, uh, not purple, blue. This kind of just bland blue. Not a biggest fan of this color tone, which it is. It's a direct match of the one we just got, unfortunately. All right. What do we got in this one? We got things peeking out. I just saw a jelly. It wasn't this one, I guess, though. That is a weird looking dude. What's up with that? Does he have sideburns or is that his cheekbones? Interesting. Kind of like brainy looking double eyebrow man. Four eyebrows over here. Pretty funny. What do we got here? Ooh, there it is. Look at that. Does he have painted feet? He's got painted feet too. Again, a nice little caricature face. I like that. I do appreciate how they just went for it with some of these faces. Some uh, are more successful than others. I feel like here's our brain man. There we go. In that nice jelly purple too. There's our brain boy. The brain or something like that. You, you know what? My guesses will probably be pretty accurate to the actual names of nope. these things, which will be funny, but this is a nice one. Good. My box has fallen over here. It is just that this box was wrecked. <laughs> there wasn't any saving it. I taped it up a little bit uh, just for display, which I'll put it back up on display on the shelf, but uh, you know, it was just uh, kind of ruined. Give me a focus. There we go. Look at that. They put blue on the inside inner lip. That is cool. Again, impressive painting. I want to know what the process is for doing paint like this in such large quantities. There's the other one. So we got this one before. Is it coming off or is that how it's supposed to be? I wonder. I like this yellow though. That's a sharp yellow. Last one in this. Oh, come on. Look at that. Oh my gosh. He looks like something from Futurama. Is it like the Futurama squid claw hand guy? I don't watch Futurama. All right, forgive me. I'm sorry, I don't. But he looks like that dude with the big, huge mustache and this huge eye on his head. That is cool. I like him. It's like a dark green. Not showing up great on the camera, but it is looking pretty sweet in person. Next, let's do it. Oop, rip the checklist on that one. That's okay. Let's pull out our first purple man. We've got this joker looking dude with a giant chin or something. I don't know. We got that one before. I wonder if we'll be able to get the whole thing. This is the El Unicorne, as he's got a giant unicorn thing on his head. Not a fan of that paint job, though. It'd be interesting if we could get the whole set. That'd be crazy. Ooh, nice. We got this guy, but this one is sharp. What color did we get him in last? Ah, we got him in a purple, so this is our jelly color of him. That looks pretty sweet. Uh, another one. Let's see what's in this one here. Open it up get the checklist out oh oh well we lost one. Oh, almost ran over it with my chair oopsies but here it is oh it's this guy okay all right well i'm not worried about him one of my lesser favorites so far but we do have this guy too does he have horns on his head i can't tell it almost looks like he has horns but let's see we've got oh the boil man now we got him he's right there we got him in a pink okay there we go. Nice orange. Fan of the orange. That one's cool. Oh, man. Oh, man. Let's see what else we got in here. All right. First up, we've got our demon dude, our little Satan, our little Satan man over there in a purple. Looks fine. Looks fine. And then our next one, we've got, oh, Muscle Man, complete duplicate of Mr. Muscle, which is cool. I kind of like him. He, he's grown on me. His abs obviously look out of place, but he is kind of funny. And this guy, which we did get as well. So lots of duplicates. How many figures are there? There's only 40 figures in the set too. So it probably is pretty easy to get all of them. Obviously you can see we're getting lots of duplicates. 
Um, but that's okay because we want to go for those golds, which we haven't found a gold yet. So I'm hoping we'll get at least one in the box. That'd be nice. First up, though, we've got... Ew. Oh, is this Cactus? Is this Mr. Cactus or something? It might be, but it just looks like he has chicken pox. Gross. Yeah, I don't know about that design. I think they're going for a cactus design, but I don't know if it worked. A nice red jelly of Unibrown Man. Very sweet. And then our last one in this pack. I can get it out. Oh, ooh, let's go. Yes, a nice silver. Oh, sweet. And a character we don't have either. Very nice. Look at that. Sharp, sharp, very sharp. And you know what? Considering Go-Go's made their silver gold medals uh, hollow, this one doesn't feel hollow. Obviously, it's got just a coating on it, but it's got a little bit more weight. So I really like that. Very sharp. I'm going to have to get his name. Uh, but it's cool that it's one that we didn't actually get yet. So that's awesome. Very nice. Our first silver. Now, can we get a gold? Oh, buddy. All right. We are running through these packs. Hopefully they didn't chip me on packs. I don't believe I even counted. I should have 30 packs. Did we open up 30 already? Oh, look at you. That is a cool design. I dig that a lot. That is really sweet. I don't know what you're supposed to be, but I like it. I dig that. It's kind of more on weird monster vibes, but I, oh, oh, let's go. Gold ghost, yo, absolutely. One of my favorites, <laughs> oh man. And we just got a gold ghost. Oh, oh boy. Score number 15. Again, got nice weight to it. This is fantastic. Let's go back to back on the medals. I don't know if we could find more than that, but holy crap, that is awesome looking. I love the ghost character. He's absolutely one of my faves. Absolutely. Let's see here. We got our little <laughs> Futurama matching the color scheme too almost a little bit on this one which is funny next up next in let's get it can we go three for three packs on some awesome figures hey there's a new one that one kind of reminds me of an eggy vibe almost oh wait no that's the cactus dude again i couldn't see the spots but he's got weird spots on him Ugh. yeah let me see is that who he actually is i believe so i i gotta double check i don't know what they're supposed to be doing Ooh. That guy is clean. He almost gives off like ghost vibes as well. Uh, I don't think he is, but that one's cool. That one's really cool. Very interesting. Last one from this pack. And we've got our little weird Joker dude. He reminds me of Joker, like a Joker type character uh, from like Go-Go's, not like Batman. More so from a Go-Go's Joker aspect. But all right, that one's cool. Oh yeah, we still got a few packs. Let's go. I'm having too much fun. These are great. Uh, I need to get more storage for these guys now. Ooh, yes, I wanted you so bad. That guy's sweet, man, especially in a nice jelly. We got him before, didn't we? Did we not? Oh, I thought we got him already, but we didn't, but I wanted him. Along with ghosts, this one just looks phenomenal. I think I called him out in the beginning of the video, but that looks dope. I love that. That's really sharp. What else we got in here? Let's pull out this one. We've got an orange, weird looking dude. Okay, that is our silver guy. Where's our silver? That is who our silver guy would look like. So there we go. There's a nice comparison there. He's got like a football mouth, basically. Maybe his name is football. I don't know. One more in this pack. Bang. Ooh, look at you. Oh, if your eye wasn't messed up, is it messed up or is it supposed to be like that? It might supposed to be like that. Okay. Well, that's cool. I like this one. That one's clean. That is a clean figure. Let's do another. Let's see what we got. All right. Huh. We'll go a little bit faster on the duplicates that we've seen already, but that is not quite a duplicate. It is our unicorn, but it is in a nice jelly yellow, very sharp. Where's our other one in here? A bang. Oh, okay. That's a straight duplicate of the ghosty man, but I won't complain because he is awesome. And that purple looks fire. And last one in here, bada bing, bada bang, a lippy girl, which we already got this one. Next, let's see what we got. Oh, I... I think I just lost like all of them. I think we got this one just fell out. Oh no. I don't know who we got. They just, <laughs> they got lost in the sauce. We do get this guy, which we got towards the beginning. He's funny. We got him in an orange, but this is a nice jelly. Who was the other one we got? Oh no. I got to go to the replay or something to try to figure it out. Crap. I don't like see any that's 
Was it you? Oh, I think it was you, maybe? That might have been in. I'm not sure. I'll have to... I don't think I see any that are different that we haven't seen, so... Oh, well. A gold didn't come spilling out or anything, so I think we're okay. But let's go into this one and see what we got here. We've got... Look at... That is big lips right there. Kissy lips. Kissy lips or big lips. One of the two. It's got to be the name. And then... Oh, get in there with the yellow. I love the clanking these make. They make a really nice, satisfying clanking noise. Again, fan of this guy. This gloppy gloob of a character. And there we go. There's our weird egg-shaped one, which we got already. hey -ya! There it is. Let's get it out and keep going in. Oh, is this new? Oh, it's a new one. Let's go. Sombrero hat man with the big mustache, but like no eyes pretty much, which is kind of funny, but I like him. That looks pretty cool. Next one, we've got... Oh, wait. Is that Kissy Lips? Now, who is the true Kissy Lip queen here? I don't know. I'm not sure. One of these two. They're going to have to compete against each other for who gets the title of Big Lips or Kissy Lips, I guess. One, ki They can claim each one. Ooh, that's sweet. I love that three-eyed man. That is cool. That is a dope-looking alien figure. I love that. Oh, I can't wait to get that in, like, a better color. Because this one's not doing it justice. We've only got three packs left, though, and we need to find Draco before the video ends. So let's go. Just a couple packs left. All right, can we find the Draco? Get this out. Get this in. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay, we got you. We'll move on. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, there's our little cool springy dude, which I dig him. I dig him a lot. And then we've got Kissy Lips, our third of this one, I believe. I think we've gotten three of it now in this yellow specifically. Let's do one more here. Come on, come on, come on. We've got, oh, is this new? Oh, nope, it's our muscle man. Big, round, and bulky, basically. And then we've got, all right, our little cool looking side smile, whatever. And then our last one in this pack is, ew, the gross blue one that I don't really like. Again, another triplicate here of this one. Hey, I'm so sad. We don't have any more packs. We just got one left. These were a lot of fun, though. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed opening these, and I will get to opening up the original series, too, because I did have fun with these. So if you want to see more of Draco Heads, leave a comment down below. Subscribe for more GoGo's openings and Draco Head openings. The last pack, though. Let's see what we can get in this one. Either give me a gold or give me the Draco man himself. And then we'll see if we, how many we got out of the total 40. Let's see who we got here. All right, we got this one already. Kind of just a nice looking, this is the better of the girl ones from the set, I think. And who else we got in here? Bada bing, oh, our top hat man, which again, another one that we got. Don't tell me we got a repeat of the very first pack on the last pack. Come on, we're not bringing it together like that. We <laughs> Oh my gosh, what is the chances of that? That's funny, a complete duplicate of the very first pack. That's crazy, I've never, I, that's that's weird, that's weird. I wonder if there's a set like uh, how they place them in bags is kind of already structured, I don't know. Well, there's all the guys we got from today. I was about to go sort them and see how many I got out of the 40, but I gave up and my memory's running low. So here's a look at all of them. We got a bunch of duplicates, so I'm guessing maybe we got like, I don't know, 20 out of 40. I'll put it up on screen here and you guys can see how we did out of getting the whole run or series. But some highlights, of course, are these nice gold and silver awesomeness. Really, really sharp. And I'm so happy I got it in the ghost guy because he's awesome. I mean, come on. That just looks phenomenal, right? These guys are super cool, though. We didn't get Draco, so we might have to go back in get some more of these guys, maybe find another box somewhere of this if I can get it at a reasonable price. The nice thing is the rerun version is cheaper than the original series, so that might be more doable to try to find a few extra characters. But thank you for watching all the way to the end. I really appreciate it. And again, subscribe. Stick around for more content with Go-Go's and Draco Heads and all sorts of cool stuff on the channel. We're opening up so much, and I've got so much on the wall over here that I can't wait to jump into with you guys, so stay tuned for those. Make sure to just click right here on either side of me to check out some more cool Go-Go -Go videos or other random content on the channel. And we will see you guys in the next video.